Vacubrus and front and side and vacubrus and front and side and vacubrus and front, side, back. Reverse. Three, four and one. <laughs> Three U brus and pique, pique, pique brus and chete, chete, chete. Oh my god. Thanks. Mm. Let's try my best. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you've been on here long enough, you know that I'm a ballroom dancer and I have never tried any other type of dance. But for today's video, since I have so much free time on my hands now, well not so much, but you know, I have more free time, I decided to try some online ballet classes. And for this video, we will be having the Dutch National Ballet join us to try and teach me some ballet. So the first video I'm gonna do is ballet bar one. We can start our bar. We're going to start that uh, facing the bar. And we're going to start with a tendu de front. You rotate in, you rotate back out, and you flex plie. Tendu de front, brush through, brush through, and close. To the side you start the same. You rotate in, rotate two legs out, flex plie, tendu de one five, and six, three in the first, this time. I'll do it with you. Uh, ah. Oof, this is like a lot. Okay. Tendu front. Rotate out. Flex plie. Good brush. Same to the sides. Rotate out. We take three tendus in the first. Same to the back. We rotate two legs out. Flex. Over with your right. Easy for the bras. One. Roll through, press the floor away, keep lengthening out of your hips. And to the other side. Two legs are working, you flex, push away. Sun. And close. Two legs working, flex, rotate even more. Tandu, point. Same to the back. Flex, push. Order, front. Up first, and in the sides. Roll through, press. And we're going to finish there with a nice little balance. And lowering. In the first, we'll take a port de bras front and four count, and a nice demi point. You take a balance, and you go into second. So it's a demi plie with the arm set under the arm the second time. This is a lot. This is a lot. Oh, it's a lot. Arm side under the arm. Now you go forward, stretch, and you rise and balance. In second, same thing, arm stay side. Now use your upper body. And the quarter bra goes up and back, up to go back. Rise and balance, try and get your ankles really still. Transfer. Demi. Demi. Same to the back. 
lengthening on your left leg. Last time in fifth. Arm stays side. Demi. Under your arm. Ground the eight. Now pour them all the way around. Breathing out. Down. And a good finish. And I don't know what any of this terminology is. If you're a ballet dancer, can you like explain what exactly pot of ray is? Is it like, is it just going around? Like what? <laughs> I have no knowledge of like ballet technique pretty much other than like positions. Uh, make sure that you do it as well as the right. You won't see me, um, but we'll do the left side now. We'll do exactly the same with each exercise at the bar. Good, you guys. Let's move on with the tandu from the first, please. Okay, I kind of get this part now, but I'm not going to do it again because I did it on both sides. But I think I'm going to make up my goal to memorize it eventually. If I keep doing this video every single day, I'll probably memorize it. I probably will. Although I'm kind of still confused on like the direction of the arms and when exactly they go up and like when they go around. Arm to the side and we go tandu one, demi plié, tandu one. Demi plie in forts, tendu up, you flex plie and tendu back to first, same to the side. Demi plie to the side, into the second, ah. then you stretch. Demi plie in first, my feet one bit of demi plie in the fourth, tendu front, plie. Back on one, little slower, and one, stretch it out from the back of your legs, up and back, rotate out, roll through, and we'll finish there, keep lengthening, open and about halfway through the video and that last combination this is the fourth combination so let's see how I do but it looks really confusing this is really hard two front fifth up good fifth position arm flipping plie plie four side to the back Juicy, please, juicy. 
Juicy. Four sides. Out. Good, well done. That was very Maybe confusing. Why is it so hard? You brush and front and side and back. You brush and front and side and back. You brush and front, side, back. Reverse. Three, four, and one. <laughs> Three, you brush and pique, 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 brush and chete, chete, chete. Oh my god. Thanks. Mm. Let's try my best. Pique. Light piques. Front, side, back. Brush and, and peek. Front side back last time. Back side front you brush. Back side front you brush. One. This really hurts ankles. Thanks, really Rex. Fun. We'll go uh, round the jump from a fifth position. Side and front. Finishing front, vertebra. Pick up the leg to the arabesque line. Sucked. Round the jump. Stretch and through. One. Forward and back. Up to go back. And all the way back. Into your arabesque line. You can take that into a punch shape. Bring it up back to your arabesque, really nice and square. Out, close fifth. Passe up. Try and balance there, keep lengthening on that standing leg. Nice first positions, your chest. All right, shake your legs out. Ow. Okay, overall the bar class was challenging because I just don't have any basic knowledge of like arm movements and like I don't know what any of the words that they're saying means. You know, they might sound familiar in dance terms, but I don't know what they mean in ballet terms. But now I'm just going to do some tutorials for actual ballet steps and we're going to start with trying to learn a tombe pas de bourrée. I don't even know what that is, but uh, we're about to find out. Oh my gosh, she speaks French. French. I learned French in school and I should not speak it, I understand it, but I don't. So. Okay, I don't have a floor, but I have a carpet and socks, so that should work. Okay. Right foot in front, fifth position. Arms are low. Arms are low. And then begin ik met my rechter schouder naar achter. Right shoulder back. In plié met rechts naar voor, tendu. And ik val op my rechter been. That is tombe. En pas de bourré is stap achter, zij en stap naar voren. En ik doe stap achter, zij en sluit. Oké, okay, I'm a little confused. So what it looks like to me is, you start out in fifth position. I'm definitely doing this wrong. Please don't judge me. If you're actually a ballet dancer, I, like, please don't judge me. I'm just trying my best, okay? Left shoulder back. Forwards. Tall chest right, I think. Here, okay, from here, da, or like this. It was just like, it was just like one step. I don't even know. I'm gonna look at this again. Stomp in. And pas de bourré is stap achter, zij, en sluit. In vijfde positie. Ik laat nog een keer naar links zien. Zij, en sluit. Als je hier naar een pirouette zou komen, doen we bijna altijd onze arm. Forwards, up, step, cross, down, into fifth position. Ta, 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 ta. C 
See, my feet don't go in fifth position. They keep going like this. How do they do this? And like this? Oh, it's really hard. I mean, I can stand like this, but I can't move. That's highly difficult. That's like my closest understanding of how to do this. Yeah, we'll just move on to something else. Now I'll see what a promenade is, because I know what promenade is in ballroom, and I can do it. I don't know what it is in ballet, so we'll find out. Leuk dat jullie weer kijken naar onze tutorial en welkom bij ons in de studio. I really like this girl. I really like her. Gewoon flat We beginnen in een tendu achter. Okay. En zoals in de vorige tutorial waarin we een arabesque <laughs> hebben gedaan, precies die houding gaan we aannemen. Dus oh, mijn this. armen zijn nu in eerste arabesque positie. Mijn voet komt van de grond. Dus nu begint de balansoefening al. En wat we doen is lang. <laughs> dus mijn gewicht is een beetje op mijn voorvoet en ik probeer precies te houden en daar kunnen we na de arabesque ook naar attitude gaan. Nee, en het ligt een beetje op de voorvoet en met kleine... I'm confused as to how she turns on a flat foot. Oh, she moves her like heel beetjes. forwards. And this, this is a promenade, ballroom promenade. I like so much better. Turns by moving her heel like this. That is understandable to me, it's just, maybe it's also harder on carpet, I don't know, but I'm not gonna use that as an excuse, I just can't do this. Okay, I can balance like this. One, two, three. Let's learn a ronde de jambe. That sounds very fancy. Hallo allemaal, wat leuk dat jullie weer kijken naar onze ballet tutorial. En vandaag gaan we werken aan een ronde jambe. En dit gaan we doen aan de bar en we gaan via een tendu voor naar opzij. En wat we willen doen is hier heel erg letten op de uitdraai, het opwarmen van de heupen. Je wil de rotatie in je heup voelen en we sluiten in eerste positie. Als we dat sneller doen, ziet een ronde jamp er zo uit. En wat we vaak aan de bar doen, door, zij, achter, sluit. En we gaan weer door en we maken mooie halve cirkels op de grond. Gebruiken. Oh, this is the thing dan that onze was in the bar class. Om hetzelfde. Met de hele tijd denkend aan de uitdraai. Dus een ronde jam, naar alle seconden, naar arabesk. Denk aan de rotatie in je heup. En sluit. En je kunt een ronde jam steeds hoger maken. En dat kan je helpen bij een heleboel andere grote balletpassen. Ik hoop dat je deze tutorial leuk hebt gevonden. Well, I think that was the only thing I was somewhat capable of doing. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see me try some other ballet stuff, feel free to send me links to videos or maybe some choreography that you want me to try, either ballet or dance, like any other styles of dance. I mean, there's lyrical, jazz. If you are a ballet dancer, make sure to comment down below and let me know how I did. If I have any potential of possibly making a decent ballet dancer, I'm just curious as to how much I sucked doing all of this ballet stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye!